Hello, hope everybody's doing well today. Um, I'm excited, although I have, do have a small pit in my stomach from earlier, but that's a different story. We are going to be playing... Hold on, I want to uh, time this. I just got a Pride Jun now, Poggers. Nice. Uh, we're going to be playing Pokemon Legends Arceus. I have been waiting for this game ever since it was announced. I know people said, oh, it looks like crap, it looks like crap. But I've actually been, like, super, super stoked by this. Hello, General. How's it going? General. Twitch, please load. Is it not loading? Hold on, I gotta fucking fix my phone. I'm going to fuck Bezos' dad on, uh... The tutorial is long, just a heads up. No worries. I don't mind a good tutorial. Welcome to my realm, located beyond both time and space. It is well that thou art here. I am which humans call Arceus. Okay, I'm back. Welcome back. Also, I forgot to ask, how's it going, Rose? How's it going, Fix? How's it going, General? Oh, homework? I, okay. General, I, I hope, uh, if you need help with homework, just let us know. Now, I wish to know thine appearance. It is going great. Ate a lot. Nice. I'm glad you managed to, uh, that you're feeling good. It's easy homework, but I still hate it. Yeah, no, that's understandable. Made some doodles in your sketchbook. Why well, you gotta post that shit, you know? Unless you're uncomfortable with that. What is thy name? Oh, uh, since it all is correct, as it should be. The top left, I forgot to see that. Final. Do you really want to see Gamer Boy Holy Water? Uh, what? Mm -hmm. Soon thou shalt find thyself in a strange world to thee. A world inhabited by wondrous creatures that humans call Pokemon. Final. Seek out all Pokemon, and thou shalt find me once more. I have to find all of them? That was a really nice beginning. That is, I, that's so much different from how it usually is, and I like it very much. Oh, thanks for the phone back, Arceus. Completing the Pokedex likes you challenge Arceus is what it means. Oh, okay. My sketches are half shitposts and half actual stuff. Oh, okay. I like I like that kind of drawing. <laughs> Breath of the Wild. <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> God take boy. God takes boy's phone. <laughs> Please tell me we can make the hair green later. I have no idea. Wake up. Oh, do wake up, won't you? Why am I looking at Rowlet's crotch? 
Good news, you don't need to trade to complete said Pokex. Aw, oh, hell yeah. Are you alive, my boy? What the hell? You gave me quite the shock, falling from the sky like that. But thank goodness you seem unharmed. But thank good or Who are you? Where am I? Final my boy. <laughs> I drink buzz trick, thank you. Excuse me, that is totally not a shady guy. <laughs> Uh, where am I? Why, this is Prelude Beach, of course. Dear me, did the shock of your fall somehow addle your memory? Must say, your clothing is unusual. You wouldn't happen to have an acquaintance in these parts, would you? I don't know. I see. You seem to be in a bit of a pickle. Another hydrant, thank you. Ow, I just popped my jaw, what the hell? Might I offer some directions? Do you have somewhere around here you could stay? Nowhere. So you don't even know, you don't know anyone here and you don't even know where to spend the night. Well, this is a proper pickle indeed. Are you sure you'll be able to survive? Uh, I don't know what to do. Hello, Ellie. Aren't you blonde? Yes, but I... I'm also... I was, I'm a lot paler, IRL. I see. Well, no gentleman would abandon a person in such need. I like his hat. Crew. <laughs> Fum. <laughs> Plish plash. <laughs> Oh my, I completely forgotten. I had cut up to these three runaway Pokemon when you tumbled out of the sky. It's almost as if I knew you would appear here. Cyndaquil, my beloved. I'm not choosing Cyndaquil. I don't even know what a Pokemon is. Of course I do. My, that's a relief. Though you fell from the sky, it seems we have some common ground, eh? Yes, well, these three Pokemon belong to me. Mysterious creatures that they are. Oh yes, and what might na your name be? Final. <laughs> oh, so you're called Final. My music teacher chose Syndicwill. Nice. The name has quite the ring to it. I imagine it must have some lovely meaning. But if only you knew. But I do apologize, I haven't even introduced myself. My name is Laventon. I'm somewhat thumbing of a Pokemon professor. That is to say, I'm a scholar seeking to deepen our understanding of Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon such as these three will. Oh, Blast and Bother. My darling Pokemon, why must you run from me again? I'm terribly sorry, but do you think you're going to help me round them up? I beg you. Wait, you three, wait. Is this gamer? He played Among Us when it was a big thing? Wow. What happens if I go into the water? Damn it. I don't see how people say this is ugly. This is really nice. Is there a way to... I can't adjust the cameras yet. I chose Oshawa because I like uh, Hisuian Final Evo. Nice. Keep it in control, fuck's sake, Madge. <laughs> I do like Cyndaquil, but I do not like his suing form. People only said it was ugly because the trailers have compressed shit. That they do, but I've heard like people rag on it anyways. Oh, I love how like the target is an RCS ring. There's a deep glow beeping object over there. K 
Can I please look at it? There we go. You found something that resembles a phone. It's probably your phone, but it changed shape. You feel a strange power emanating from it. A message appeared on the screen. They will bestow upon thee this arc phone, and thy mission, seek out all Pokemon. Oh, there we go. Um... That's much better. Do you note there are no held items? That's actually kind of pleasant. Scuff stream? What? God steals and tempers a 13 year old's phone. It's strange when a Pokemon uploads itself. Oh, that's Crouch. Now I can, I can teabag a Pokemon. <laughs> Nothing at all. Alas, yet another mess. I'm glad you come to my rescue, my new friend from the sky. I tried catching my, my little runaways by tossing some Pokeballs their way, but I'm not the best at the sort of thing you see. I'd love to give you uh, I'd love to give you a go at it, but perhaps I should tell you about these three first. Now that one is Rowlet. I love how it walks. Rowlet can photosynthesize like a plant, and apparently it battles using its sharp feathers. I love it. <laughs> Leventon, please stay at least 10 feet away from me. The fire burning when Cyndaquil's back will flare up when it's surprised or irate. Fum. The Pokemon near the pond is Oshawott. Oshawott naps while floating on the water, and it can battle using the shell-like object on its belly. Dishbash. Oh my, I nearly forgot to cover the most crucial thing, how to go about catching Pokemon. There you go, my boy. Pokeballs. Throw these at the Pokemon to catch them. Obtained 50 of them. Wow. Fun fact, Rushwa uses its shell as a pillow. Interesting. Poke nuts. <laughs> D these poke nuts. Ah, but that won't do for an explanation. Well, let I do apologize. Let me be more thorough. I've mentioned already that Pokemon are strange, marvelous creatures. What's so strange about them, you ask? Well, each and every Pokemon is able to shrink itself down to minuscule size. Now, see... <sighs> I always thought, like, Pokemon going to Pokeballs was, like, kind of like a downloading its form into, a, like, a version of light that's stored in the Pokeballs. Kind of like fiber optics within the ball. Oh, and that's where Pokeballs come in. Pokeballs are a recent invention, you see. Throw one at the Pokemon and... Why, the Pokemon will shrink down and fit inside the ball, comfy as can be. And with that, you've caught a Pokemon. I know we just met, but I'm afraid I have no one else to turn to. I'd be awfully grateful if you could catch my three runaways. Now the proper technique is to aim at this Pokemon and let the ball fly. It's quite simple. That would be far from me to say so, I suppose, given my own dire lack of skill in the area. Oh, ZR. Okay. Right stick to adjust your angle and aim carefully at the target Pokemon. Okay. Release ZR to throw the Pokeball. If it hits a Pokemon, you, you may be able to catch it. If you're ready a Pokeball but do not want to throw it, press B to cancel. Oh. 
That's actually quite cool. Nice. Wonderfully, you caught a Pokemon. It seems you have quite quite a knack for this Pokemon catching business, Final. Jolly useful skill to have around here. Only two of my darling runaways left now. This is most unusual. You don't seem fearful of Pokemon in the slightest. Tell me they can pull an Ant Man. Also, forgive me for the uh, massive ship posting. I'm not huge on Pokemon, but I also want to be here. No worries. You don't have to. If 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 you don't if you're not big on Pokemon, you don't have to like be here. But if you want to like be here, I don't like. Oh. Okay, I just... Oh, I keep forgetting to press B. Also, hello, Zed. How's it going? I'm a mod? Yeah, uh, that, that makes sense. Well, just because you're a mod doesn't mean you have to be here. It's not a hidden fact, but I know a ton about Pokemon since I'm born with them. You were born with Pokemon? You can press ZL to lock it helps a lot. Oh, okay, thank you. Are they believed final? Incredible. You know, many people fear po to even approach Pokemon. Never mind catch them. Bravo indeed. Just one more go. Let's wrap this up sharpest, shall we? I actually kind of like this. Instead of being, like, shown... Excuse me. Instead of being shown by, like, some strange old man in, like, the third town you go to, I really like this. I like that. The, the Z all really helps. Oh. Ah, yes, I'm afraid that can happen. <laughs> My guy looks so distraught like it just ran over his dog or something. Every po I was born on the same day as the first Pokemon games came out in Japan. Nice. Every Pokemon day is also my birthday and I get double the gifts. Nice. Pokeballs are hardly 100% foolproof. Give, full Give it another goal. Oh, boy. There you go. Thank you very much indeed. Oh, what a relief to have them all back. You see, the three Pokemon you have caught just only arrived at the village with the help of our research. Only arrived at the village to help with our research. They won't let yet. They won't yet listen to anyone. I can speak properly, I swear. And as I mentioned, they bolted from the village almost as if they knew to become falling. But I must say, final, I was taken aback by how well you use Pokeballs. How is it that you catch Pokemon so ably when you've only just arrived here? I can't help but think there's a reason you appeared here and now. Seek out all Pokemon. That object is an arc phone, you say. What an odd device. Could it be guiding you somehow? If you indulge me for a moment, there's something I'd like to share with you. You see, I have a dream to compile this region's first complete record of its Pokemon. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. I'll... <sighs> May the field call such a catalog of Pokedex. Yes, a proper Pokedex is a wonderful work of uh, research containing all detailed records of all the Pokemon to be found in the region. But in order to pre properly document Pokemon, one must, of course, catch them. And therein lies the rub, I'm afraid. Pokeballs have only been invented, and not many have mastered the skill of using them. Enter you, a Pokemon with clear talent for catching Pokemon. Your goal is to seek out every Pokemon, and mine, mine is to have all those Pokemon caught. A ripe situation for t er, situation ripe for teamwork, don't you agree? Look, ice cream, okie dokes fix. Hope you enjoy your ice cream. 
<laughs> yes, Arceus FaceTime me and said to hunt Pokemon. <laughs> Come now, what do you say? Shall we help one another out? Help one another out, my boy? You've convinced me, sure. You're creepy as hell, but I like your hat. Then whoever, then whoever, and from wherever you may be, I welcome you with open arms. We have a Pokedex to complete. First things first, let's get these Pokemon back to the village. Then we'll sort out your lodgings and find you some proper clothes and a meal and all that. Follow me then. Onward to Jubilife Village. Wait, Jubilife? Really? Oh, what the hell is that? I got the game yesterday. It took me an hour to complete the tutorial. And I just beeline to finish it. I think I'm just going to enjoy this game. Thank you for your tireless work keeping us safe, my good guardsman. This young man was of great assistance to me and my Pokemon, so I hope you forgive my bringing him into the village for a bit. That you're done with it so you can enjoy the game i i i definitely will like i've like like i said at the beginning of the stream i've been looking forward to this game ever since it was first announced honestly it was more or less in a rush ah. i just wish the right side of my headset would work this way if you please Jubilee Village. It's come a long way to thanks to the fine people of the Galaxy Expedition Team. I understand you must be in a more than tad. Oh, fuck. The road we're on now is known as the locals as Can uh, Canala Avenue. I understand you must be more than a tad curious about the village, but please do follow me for now. The village was personally cut two years ago. There's much to do and not many to do it. <laughs> please slow down. And so we still know a little about the outside, but people hesitate to set out foot outside. Foot sat outside the village. Now that impressive building up ahead has a Galaxy Hall headquarters for this entire outfit. That's a nice building, actually. When I first run, I run into every possible legendary in my path because I was that unlucky and actually caught them in Pokeballs. <laughs> oh, botheration. I'd almost forgotten. I need to go and report that we successfully reco recovered the escape Pokemon. Might I ask you to wait for me at the canteen? Just past this bridge and then to the left. The Wallflower, it's called. Your arc phone is beeping. Somehow it seems to show you where you need to go next. The minus button for map. Awesome. You also see guidance markers when you're out exploring or running around the village. You're not sure where to go next. Stop and look in all directions, but try to, sp to try to spot one of these markers and head for it. Best ways of 30 or 300 for... Is, is there actually, like... Uh, I actually really like this music. I'm going to turn it up on my headset a little bit. All legendaries in this game are shiny locked. Really? They're... Oh, you can't get shinies? I'll investigate some of this shit later. This is actually a very pleasant, like, it's not too, like, claustrophobic, it's actually kind of nice. Only with Hex, ah. Uh, Star Pokemon is also trying to lock. I kind of figured. Seen that child here before. They recruit for the Survey Corps. Uh, whatever. People talk too quickly. What manner of dress is that? Does the Professor know that child? Okay. 
Cantaloupe Bridge. Well, I hope you can get green hair. That guy has green hair. <laughs> well, now, aren't you awfully suspicious? Oh. The wallflowers for team Gal or for Galaxy Team Folk only. We don't have seats for outsiders. Move along. Okay, but I will say I love the female outfits. The female outfit in this game is super cute. You are, who who are you? I've never seen anyone dressed like you are. What if you were attacked by Pokemon? You'd be minced meat in those flimsy clothes. If the guard let you through, you must have some ties with somebody in the village. Perhaps you've met Professor Laventon. He's a scholar from a faraway place. His Pokemon do get away from him at times, though. Makes me a bit worried for him. I'm supposed I'm suppose I'm hardly one to talk. I've had some trouble with Pokemon myself. I was hit by a Pokemon move called Thundershock not long ago, and I had to take it to my bed. But the professor, well, I wonder how long he'll last. I heard there's an event coming up that includes a shiny starter for some kind of special event. Considering that in about 21 to 22, depending on where you live. It's my birthday, it might come close to there. Nice. Really, the only difference between Diamond Pearl and BSP is a book that explains how to get the Sea Drifter and Seafaring Pokemon in this game. Hmm. Oh. Professor! But everything will be quite alright now. Final Hero agree agreed to help us with our Pokedex. Excuse me, you plan, you plan to appoint him to the Survey Corps? You can't just slap a badge on whoever you like without Captain Silene's permission. What was... I always... I have a thought, like, did... Wait, is it Cyrus? That's the leader of Team Galactic and uh, BDSP? Because I... I think... I'm curious to know if, like... Cyrus initially had ties. You did get some special inclusions if you have a BDSP save file. Same with you. Let's go and sword shield. Oh, okay. I'll allow it. Yeah, she's she's fucking related to, or they're 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 related to, uh, Cyrus for sure. Just just those eyes alone. Assuming the individual can contribute to the Survey Corps, that is. I'm, I'm the captain of the Galaxy Team Survey Corps. You may call me Silene. <laughs> Professor Laventon has told me how he helps it cures Pokemon when they slipped his control. And now it seems he would like to feed us and house you in exchange for your ongoing labor. You look to be 15 or so. Quite old enough to work for your keep. We simply we can't simply take on a stranger who wanders in among us with any idea of their skills or origins. Tomorrow we shall see if you can prove yourself worthy. A most uh, reasonable decision, Captain. Now, would you care to join us for a meal? I'm sure you got plenty of questions for our visitor. That's quite all right. I prefer to eat alone, so I might appreciate my meals without distraction. Good news is home compatibility is coming this snowy makes it easier. Nice. Some people do look alike with some of the BDSP characters. Yeah. If as always, I see. Well, no matter. The rest of us can share a meal and some pleasant conversation then, eh? Benny, old chum. The usual potato mochi, if you please. We'll make it for three today. Wonderful stuff, Benny. Much obliged. Your potato mochi never fails to please. Professor Levinson, where exactly did you meet our visitor here? Ah, well, you know that great hole in the sky? The one people call the space-time rift? 
our new friend fell right out of it. You can't be serious. Oh, her name is Akari. I like that. That's a nice name. Come now, I am a scientist. My job is to observe and explain any and all phenomena. I only con I concern myself only with facts. Now you already know there are many Pokemon here in Hisui region. That there are, in the grass and forest, by water, wherever they like. Our job as a survey corps is to research them and find out what kind of creatures they are. Well, we know this much. Pokemon are terrifying creatures. But all impossible to know what kinds of powers they might possess or what sorts of wondrous things they can do. There's the Origin Ball, though the only Master Ball in this game. I guess because Self co invented the Master Ball. Is that true? He quickly, he successfully caught three Pokemon. Three of them in quick order. You understand. I mean, the Galaxy team is capable of a feat such as that. This means we can finally begin our Pokemon research in earnest. Three? We have a hard enough time catching even one when wild Pokemon came after us. Now, well, to be perfectly fair, the Pokemon that fled to the beach weren't on the attack. But the key to catching Pokemon is getting close enough to aim your Pokeball well. And I'm seeing our new friend is feeling us not feel us enough to do just that. Does the Survey Corps really have leeway to be enjoying a leisurely meal with, with this outsider? Your captain just ordered ten whole portions of potato mochi, you know. The slow progress on the Pokedex of yours is clearly has her on edge. I'm Slifco created the Master Ball so Giovanni can capture Mewtwo. Interesting. I didn't know that. I'm sure we'll start to rain the good captain's stress soon eating soon enough. Have your fill, final. And I think, if you make it onto the Galaxy team, you'll never have to worry about a meal again. The team provides all for all its members' needs, even if the members fell out of the sky. Nom nom nom. That was quite delicious. Quite delicious indeed. Fuck, this is nice music. Yes, the food was lovely, but more importantly, you do remember that Final has a trial to pass. To join the Survey Corps, don't you? Not to worry, I have complete confidence in Final's skills. Let's hope it's not misplaced. Final, was it? For tonight, at least, we will provide you with a place to sleep. You may use your quarters there. But if you fail to pass the trial, we put you. Or if you, fail, if you pa fail to pass the trial, we put you to tomorrow. You must move on. You will be expelled from the village to meet your fate and perhaps your death in the wilds. That sentence took a really dark turn, and I love this game for it. Do you think there'll be Cherish Balls in this game with Event Mons? Maybe. I really miss when like Pokemon games were slightly darker. If anything, and if any, if any Game Freak people by some random chance are watching this, I really want you guys to work with Genius and Ori again and make another game in the ore region similarly to uh uh pokemon xd pokemon coliseum holy crap you will die if you fail basically i like this kevin silence is somewhat like uh hisui and that they're both quite harsh now now she simply puts on a stern front to help us all keep us all safe at any rate i think it's term we time we turned in for the night a eh? Oh my goodness, he's Canadian! It's a good thing one one can't fall out of the futons while we sleep here. Imagine our, uh, imagine our new friend has enough falling for one day. <laughs> yeah, suddenly I fall off the futon and... Holy crap, I'm at another dimension. Also, hello Raxus, how's it going? Remember these are these are the same publishers as the one who made a Zelda game where someone tries to get their sister drunk so she dies and peace not knowing the world is ending excuse me which game is that one i would 
do suggest checking your mystery gift if you like. You might get some special stuff from it. Okie doke. Yes, good night. A rift in the sky and people falling from it. The world is full of mysteries. Majora's... Game Freak made Majora's Mask or are you talking Nintendo? Choi. Might you... Who, now, who might you be? I haven't seen you here in the village before. What actually tells her names? That's that's really cool. I like that. This is a nice little place. Oh my goodness, this game has garlic! What a weird detail. The survey core dude changes depending on who you choose as your character. Mine's a dude named Rai. Are you talking about, like, your rival, quote-unquote? I'm well, just don't have much to do right now, so I'm trying to get myself to do something. How about you make a meme? I don't know. Meet Nintendo, yeah. But the problem is that Nintendo has become extremely vanilla in their, I guess, details outside of Legend of Zelda, because Legend of Zelda is basically full of death and destruction. Even Metroid kind of seemed a little bit vanilla at times. Like, there was no huge fucking destruct, destroyed or whatever. I missed, I missed one, like, in, like, basically GameCube and, bef and prior had, like, darker tones to their games. A nice fire in the sunken hearth can help keep the entire room heated. The jug used to store drinking water. It has a lid down to keep debris from falling in. Oh, what's this? Survey tips contain all sorts of useful information to help you carry out your survey work in the Hisui region. To read them anytime, simply press the up button in the menu and go to help screen. Oh cool. Handy tips for team members. Don't wish your toils to be forgotten. Diligent record keeping will save you from such a fate. Ha! To you save your progress, press the up button until you reach open the menu, then scroll with ZL or ZR to save. Okay. There's also an auto save. Thank fuck, Nintendo. That you can use to save your progress uh, saved automatically. Apparently, Breath of the Wild 2 is meant to be darker than Majora's Mask. I can't wait, to be honest. This chest looks like you could store lots and lots of items in it. There's a dresser of, of a very solid construction where extra sets of clothing can be kept. Oh, cool. So if you buy extra sets, you can just go back and change. Interesting. There's some lovely stones that someone must have found. Well, they're just plain old stones. Change outfit. It's a full-length mirror. Oh. Our five principles. Behave with courtesy to others. Superiors are owed your respect. Likes and dislikes are a luxury ill-afforded. Those who are weaker must be helped. Difficulties must be faced head-on. I like those. Rest until tomorrow morning? Yes. Okay, I've now made a meme. Now I'm going to chill her. Awesome pause, I'm Raxious. What the hell? You have storage for any of your excess items and a dresser for you to keep your clothes. Breaking news, local corporate billionaire and chairman of the Galler League plans to end the world using the Eldritch Abomination. Yeah. Good morning. Final, are you up? Quite some time, quite some last lightning last night, wasn't it? It was just the one strike on a clear day. Today's the day of your trials, so or let's give it our all. 
I'm glad she knocked instead of barging right in while I was asleep. Actually, can I just go back to sleep? Oh, <laughs> I hit stop too, okay. Just get ready and head outside. Hold on. That's really interesting. Bare feet. Sandals. Bare feet. Sandals. Ray is a lot nicer to you than Akari. Well, so far I like Akari. I think I think she's just a little suspicious just because of how, like, how I came to be, you know, just kind of the situation surrounding it. I think I think she's 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 right to be a little bit. Yeah, what lovely weather we got. I hope you had a nice sleep, even if this land is strange and new to you. See, she cares. Let's get to the headquarters. Captain Silene is waiting. I am glad she is super not gung-ho like like Hop was. She's she's like, oh yeah, let's let's get this done. Hop was like, yeah, let's get this done. I'm gonna I'm gonna fuck everybody up and and become legendary. And then he gets his ass kicked and whines like a little bitch. Well, yes, you met a stranger. Who knows what they can do? Yeah. I I absolutely hated Hop as a character in Sword and Shield. He was easily the worst thing po in, in Pokemon. They're both suspicious of you. Ray is just nicer about suspicions. I guess. The Survey Corps offices are here on the first floor. Don't give up. Keep those eyes open. Pissel. Yujiro. The wild Pokemon, they, they're everywhere. Attacking from all sides. I sent out my partner Pokemon, but against a whole pack, outnumbered. This is what happens when you go so far afield. But the Medical Corps will put you to rights. That man's with a Security Corps. And even with his own partner, he took a beating from wild Pokemon. Without a partner Pokemon of your own, you might find this trial particularly trying. Captain Silene, final is here. You may enter. Holy crap, that's a lot of paperwork. Hop is like a berry plus DLC, always dropping in the wrong locations and battles you all the time. Yeah, but I don't think... Barry was never really a whiny bitch about it when he got beaten. He just kind of went, ah, shucks, I'll defeat you again, kind of thing. We're just fine enough. Let us get straight to it. If you wish to join the Galaxy Expedition team, prove yourself capable by going out into the Obsidian Fieldlands and catching three different species of Pokemon. I like that, Obsidian Fieldlands. Badoof, Starling, Shinx. Catching three Pokemon from the start? No one in the Galaxy team has ever managed that. Did the stranger not catch three different Pokemon only yesterday? My trial should be simple enough for him if the professor wasn't exaggerating, that is. The Galaxy team does not have the means to provide those who only take without giving. If you wish to stay, you must provide or prove beyond any doubt that you'll be an asset to our cause. I will lend you one of our Survey Corps satchels to carry whatever you may need in the field. It's a fun little satchel. That satchel doesn't exactly match uh, your mode of dress. Kari. I expect you to step in if anything goes awry. Ooh, ooh. I, I like that. I, I like the little quest title. Ooh, you're new. <laughs> Hello, Abyssa. How's it going? Evolving Pokemon is a lot better in this game. Animation is, is cool, though. I look forward to seeing it. I just don't 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 give too many spoilers if you know, if you know what's going up. If if you say like, oh yeah, this is cool, this is cool, I uh, that that'll accept. Just don't be like, this is what this looks like. 
Unless it's like... I'm extremely stumped. Press the Y button while consulting the map on your ARC phone. And you can check the tasks you have waiting. There are two types. Missions and requests. Missions must be completed to progress in your adventure while requests are optional and given by people you meet. Nice. Pardon final, come with me a moment. Now then, a jolly good morning to everyone. You also get to choose when you can evolve your Pokemon after they reach the evolution requirements. Really? So you're not pestered every time you level up kind of thing? Oh, that's that's really cool. I like that. Something the matter, Professor Laventon. In order to complete our Pokedex and, well, simply survive in this unforgiving land, Final must absolutely, or absolutely must pass his trial. And a professor of Pokemon, I've got the ticket to help accomplish that. Crew! <laughs> Boom. Plish Plash. Go on, Final, pick the Pokemon that strikes your fancy. With a partner of your own, you'll be able to fight off wild Pokemon outside the village. Hell yeah. That's what I mean. It, that's what I mean by it's a lot better. No, yeah, I'm just giving like for future reference kind of thing. It's great for you want a specific move that only the current form can get, but, but not its evolution by leveling up. Hmm. These little darlings are very dear to me, but it's plain to see they're rather curious about you. One more way, which Pokemon would you like to keep as your very own? I already know which one. Do you want Rowlet as your first partner? Yes. I want Funny Round Owl. I love how it walks. And with that, one of the Pokemon you caught will be kept at... One of the Pokemon you caught at Prelude Beach for me will now be yours to keep. Good show. I've tucked Rowlet back inside its Pokeball for you, so you can take it. It's yours. Getting a leafy on Glaceon, they only need to be near the mossy rock, whatever it is for Glaceon. The frozen rock, yeah. So far, everyone I've seen chose the other two, but Owling can be very powerful. Yep. A word of advice, my boy. Play, pay close attention to which Pokeballs are empty and which ones contain a Pokemon. When you're out in the field. They look as though if they're cheering on their friend Rowlet. Perhaps they're the jealous that you get to help you out with their help out with you in your trial. That could well be. Well they did go dashing from the village when final fell out of the sky after all. Well not to worry you two, I'll have you assist me with my own research for now. Fum the bash. By the by, what species has Captain Silene charged you with catching? Well, that's smashing. All three of those species can be found in the Obsidian Fieldlands. Let me give you some Pokeballs to use during your trial, then. Another fucking 20. I wonder if Regigigas is still locked up early in the pass. Maybe? You, get the other, you can get them as well as the other two in the stars in the later parts of the game. Awesome, I was wondering how, like, you get you get it. It may not have an answer for that. <laughs> well, it's Evil Long got screwed in this gen. Its first two Evos have a better chance to beat its final. Oh well. Also, hello Aya, how's it going? Type wise, okay. Well, I don't know. I don't know the final types, but I'm, I'll, I'll see when I get there. These Pokeballs may be handcrafted by the work of treat, as you've already seen. You'll have this trial cleared at no time. I guess you're finally ready. You'll have to leave the village for your uh, for your trial. Turn left after you exit the headquarters, then head to the gate. At least she's helpful. Oh, I lost all 50, okay. I won't spoil thing. I appreciate that, Aya. Was the humans we, who locked up the titans for what? I don't know lore-wise. That I don't know. Uh, 
Oh, and what a curious getup you have there. I can already tell you're quite the character. Oh, don't tell me this is the Edgelord. I'm Volo of the Ginkgo Guild. The go-to choice for any of your... Mer okay, it's, it's a merchant then. I get that. For any of your mercantile needs here in Hisui. I've heard talk about you. You fell from the sky, didn't you? Now, certainly a tale I like to hear. Oh, and you have a Pokemon. You're certainly full of interesting surprises. Cynthia's ancestor. Is that? I guess I can see the similarities. Well, it was going to be changing its type upon reaching the final evolution, but with this game, all three stars have different evos with an extra type. Interesting. Can't say much about Reach Regis. This game, you have a quest around the Regis. Okay, so the, there's... Are... Is there a lot... Okay, you don't have to go into, like, details of who. Are there a lot of legendaries in this game? Regigigas was first in, uh, discovered in the Sinnoh region. Regirock, Registeel were in Hoenn. Yes. Investigating the Auden novel is a key to any good merchant success. So what do you say? How about you and I see how our Pokemon set up to one another in battle? Sure, why not? I like to find I like you better and better. What a delightful find. I've also heard about this trial you to attempt. Let's have a quick battle to get your blood pumping before you head out. Though I hope you know if you'll lose if your Pokemon's HP reaches zero. Inko Guild member Vol challenge you to battle. Oh, I can actually... Oh, it's really cool that I can... Oh, I really like... I really like this music. Oh, this is such a banger. If only I could control the route to run around. You'll know when you see Cynthia's ancestor. It's not Volo. Okay. Rigid Gigas. Only a few. Only know Orcreus, Manaphy, and Fionnui? You just mean Fion? 17. In total, there's 17 legendary in this game. Oh, okay, cool. God, this music goes hard. I love it. Nice. Moves, items, use them well, and the world will open up to you. Nice. I I really like that. Manaphy is the prince of the sea, and Fiona is the sea drifting Pokemon. Okay. Oh, I completely missed skip. I fucking skipped the first one. They gain experience through battle, and then meh. Sometimes Pokemon learn new moves when they level up. If you want to change the move your Pokemon can use in battle, open your satchel. Choose the Pokemon you want and select change. You can actively change the moves of your Pokemon? Oh, that's fucking sick. I am going to love this game. They did so many things right so far. I love it. So people here have their own Pokemon. If only more people more knew how to use Pokeballs. At any rate, let me help our, our two battles recover from their little exercise. And to you, my sky fallen friend, I present some potions and thanks. I obtained five potions. Nice! 60 HP. Was it only 60? I thought it was 50. No, potion was 20 usually, wasn't it? Best about this thing. This game, you always have something to do. I love that. 
You can also actively change the names. Nice. You can use them on your Pokemon whenever you might be worn out from battle. I'll be hoping that you're successful in that trial of yours. More Galaxy team members mean more customers for yours truly, after all. That's really something. Not only can you catch Pokemon, you can lead them in battle. Now to the Obsidian Fieldlands. Well, when you're leaving Jubilife, make sure you choose a destination from your map and tell the rest of the guardsmen where you're going. That way someone can come to your aid if you're knocked out by a Pokemon. Oh, okay. Your trial begins just a short way past that front gate. Found correct. I was informed you'd be passing through. Your trial will take place outside the safety of their village. Please take care to come back alive. Depart for the okay. This is I've I fucking love this game so far. This is our base camp, the last safe haven before you reach the wilds. For your trial, you must catch three species of Pokemon, Bidoof, Starly, and Shinx. Are you ready to get started? Oh, Professor, something wrong. Ah, well, you see, Captain Silene got a hold of me after you left. She impressed upon me that I bear full responsibility for whatever happens to our sudden guest. That's our unsparing captain. But what help exactly can you offer out there, po uh, Professor? To be honest, my dear girl, I don't intend to lift a finger. Final talents are the real deal. You'll pass with flying colors, you see. Especially green. As so the responsibility for him still lies in fact with me, then. I'm sure final will be fine. Let's begin the trial. I can't wait to get, like, actual clothes and whatnot. Oh, I heard a Pokemon's. Oh. Unfortunately, I get the feeling you'll only be able to transfer Pokemon caught in this game between accounts. Not be able to transfer Pokemon from other games or Pokemon that are exclusive to this game or other games. Yes, because that will be an extreme load on on uh, certain platforms. Oh, I guess I can't go that way. This is Aspiration Hill. The species of Pokemon you're meant to catch all live here. What? And along comes a Bidoof. Time to get ready. I really wish the text was slightly slower. The key is to aim carefully. Not that you seem to need my advice, I'm just sharing what I know. Badoof has a mellow disposition. That means it tends not to run from people, so this will be easy. Yay! <laughs> <Yeet>. Oh. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> uh, Pokemon exclusive to the game, I mean the history forms. Yeah. You've caught a Bidoof. Well done. Time to find your next Pokemon. At least it makes that tutorial a little bit fun that you can actually just futz about and explore. Oh. Are you sure you know where you're going? Yes. Damn it. There's a Starly. They're skittish little things. They'll run if startled. But you should be able to get close to them if you crouch. You'll be harder to spot.
crap, she startled the Starly. Oh, the wind sound is a little bit mellowed if you crouch down. That's cool. I'm glad it doesn't have to shake three times. Stealth optional. <laughs> the way you evolve Basculin in this game is funny. I won't even say it until you get Basculin. Well, I'm, I'm sure I'll, I'll figure it out. The Starly caught us. The Starly caught us. Only one more Pokemon to go. I got an Apricorn. Medicinal leak. I can collect things in this game. That's awesome. I wonder if it has a crafting thing. That'd be cool. Okay, I wanted to go to the bush. Stealth is optional for missions. Stealth was never an option. It's not something you can discover by accident. Okay, because even if I get a basket, I think I'll figure it out myself then. I forgot. There's something I ought to teach you since you're still new to this. Here's the proper way to throw your partner's Pokeball. As Captain Silene tells us, have an item at the ready but want to send out a Pokemon? Press X. Pokemon are ready, but want to throw an item? Press X. Captain is a real expert on these things. Try throwing your Pokeball at rocks or trees like this one to have it investigate. If Pokemon finds any berries or other items, it'll bring them to you. Huh. Now it's time for your Pokemon partners to shine. We reached your final hurdle, catching a Shinx. Huh. Oh, and you get XP for that. Oh, that's really cool. You sometimes get items after battle, and yes, you can gather a ton of stuff for crafting. Awesome. Oh, I bet you this is like some sort of ore. Oh, it looked up at me. I love it. It's so cute. <laughs> I wonder if there's anything else. Okay. Stantler, Baskin, and Scythe are missing any. Growlithe, Azorua, and some others. Okie doke. There, that Shinx. Shinx has an aggressive disposition. Could you already tell that? Not at all. It meowed at me. Not to worry, these things become clear once you focus on the Pokemon around you. Once aggressive Pokemon get irates, they'll knock aside any ball you throw at them. When you use a ZL Pokemon, you can see how easy it is to catch. The more arrows you see pointing above a Pokemon, the easier it is to catch. Oh, that's useful. An X icon of Pokemon it has picked a fight with you. Be warned, Pokemon displaying this icon cannot be caught until you engage them in battle. Don't worry though, I'll teach you the trick to catch aggressive Pokemon. You've got to battle them. Once they're absorbed with battling, you can throw a Pokeball at them to try to catch them. By now, you've got several Pokemon of your own, don't you? Take one of their Pokeballs and throw it near the wild Pokemon if you want to battle. And no doubt, you'll you'll hold your own in battle. Neat. There, that Shinx. Best way to angrily say a Pokemon is too cute to be scary.
Nice. Apparently, the Porygon line is in this game. It should not be in this game. I mean, I think it makes sense, especially if it comes from the time space. You approach this Pokemon without a hint of fear and caught each one. You like you're like a gift the sky dropped at us. With you at our side, I think the Survey Corps has a real chance of compiling a complete Pokedex as we've been ordered. This is wonderful. I'm so curious on why on earth you came falling from the sky like you did. For, for now, let's tell the professor we're ready to head back. You do have the 100% capture rate. Oh, okay. Oh, it's interesting to know for, for next time, at least. I said you'd pass a trial with flying colors, but it seems that you went into just that. Congratulations, Final. Taking your first step towards seeking out every Pokemon. Calls for a commemorative photograph. Skills are like yours. I suppose this was a foregone conclusion. Now then, let's report back to Captain, Captain Silene. Time to back to Jubilee Village, eh? I like Cuba life. Can't reveal locations, but you can always look them up. In the future, I will. Where the hell's my blanket? My feet are getting fucking freezing. In time, you'll be able to send Pokemon you've caught to live in, in the village pastures. You can bring up to six Pokemon with you into the field, in theory. Though we've never had anyone skilled enough to do so. Come now, you two. Let's not dilly-dally. Captain Selene waits at her reports at the headquarters. I bet Captain Selene will be very pleased. Wonder how, if the rift is on the mountain, how the hell did you end up on the beach? Um, like anything with Nintendo, usually a curved comet. Nope. Can it follow me? Oh, you can talk with it. I think it's fun. Can it follow me? Aw, oh, damn it. I was hoping it could run around with me. I, I want to I wanna see little Rao, like, wobbling again. I gotta look cool. Gotta show Silenu's boss. I've come from the future. I just recently fucked your your ancestor up, or your your predecessor up. Is it predecessor in the in the future or? It's after me to have to be heading off the night. Good night and sweet dreams, everyone. See you next stream. All right, Zed, take care. <laughs> I work for Team Aqua because they offer free internet access. <laughs> Seems we won't be have to leave you to die after all. Nice line. Congratulations. You passed your trial. You can hold on to the satchel. I must admit you've impressed me. I set a high hurdle to judge whether a stranger like yourself shoot could be worthy, but you cleared it. This is yours, the official uniform of the Survey Corps. Excuse me, you received Survey Corps uniform and sandals. Nice. Get changed to the room you used last night, when then you're to report at once to the third floor. Present yourself in uniform to our commander. This is your first official order from your captain. When you're ready to get into your uniform, you make sure to use the mirror in your quarters. Thank you, Akari. I work for Team or I work for Team Magma because they pay for my heating bills. You want to change your outfit? Yes. Dad, put on your stuff.
Finish changing. Yes. I look fucking good. I work for Team Rocket because the name is cool. The boss is an asshole, but the name is cool. Michael Waller's survey core uniform suits you. It's almost as, as if the captain had did, tailored it just for you. I see you've changed. Reading your accommodations, uh, you may continue to use the room you slept in last night. You may wear this as well. She gave me a hat. Now present yourself to the commander. I want to go exploring. Is that... <laughs> You've been attacked by Pokemon that you can always go to base camp to rest. Thank you. For the server core now, right? You should craft your own potions. Interesting. Prepare for trouble. Make a double to prevent the world from devastation. <laughs> what the hell is this thing? Oh, it's his, I guess it's futon. Oh, ha! <laughs> he made a fireplace for it. That's awesome. Nothing here seems relevant to you. That's hilarious. What's in the basement? If you're short on items, craft more yourself. If you want to craft new items, collect recipes. Are you actually have to get recipes in this game? Huh. Oh, that's interesting. It, like, actually, like, table to craft them. Oh, you joined the server core? Cool. Commander Commodore's office is on the third floor. Keep up the good work, new kid. I still want to look around and enjoy things. That was an Eevee, of course. Wait a minute, why does this one look familiar? Was this one of the Elite Four? Sanqua. Maybe we ought to build some spare lodgings and in case anyone else falls from the sky. <laughs> nice. Oh, it's the construction. Interesting. Get Pokemon to, to help with their manual work? No way, that's crazy talk. It's a brave new land we're living in, which means there's a whole lot to do.
Lurk? Alright, thanks, schematics, for the lurk. I've been waiting for you. I'm Kamado, commander of the Galaxy Expedition Team. So you're final. Yes, sir. I've been briefed on your situation, including how you fell from the rift in the sky. Now then, let's see what you're made of. Face me in combat. Uh... <laughs> try to throw him or charge at him. Was the first shiny you've ever caught? You've missed Noggin beating the Nuzlocke. Oh, you actually beat it? Oh, congrats to him. Everyone go to go to Moist Noggin's chat and say congrats on the beating the Nuzlocke. He actually deserved it. He actually did quite a bit of grinding off stream. I know that for sure. Uh, charge at him. Yeah. <laughs> You've got vigor, I'll give you that. You need to work on your sumo technique, but I see, do see some potential. Don't expect a warm welcome from everyone. Naturally, some will be slow to trust an outsider, who literally fell right out of the blue. The superstitious among us might see your arrival as uh, potent of disaster. But you passed the trial that was put to you. No matter how odd you may seem, you're part of Jubilee Village now. Dedicate yourself to the work of the Galaxy Expedition Team and complete the Pokedex. But I warn you, final Pokemon are terrifying creatures. Keep your wits about you as you work. Hell yeah. Also, to answer your question, Rose, the first shiny I ever caught was a um. Oh, what the hell is that shell Pokemon called? With the yellow noodly arms and whatnot. I keep wanting to say Shellos, but it's not the right one. It's it's rock bug type, I think. What the hell's it called? I've never failed catching a shiny because I've never encountered one. <laughs> well, the problem is, I like I caught one very, very early on, and I know it was because they're supposed to be red, but the one I caught had a blue shell, and we thought, oh yeah, it's just blue because it's male and red because it's female. That's how the Pokemon coloring goes. What the hell is it called? Do you guys get what I mean by the yellow noodle arms? As it has a little yellow head. But the, the shell's like red and white. So the commander has also accepted you. But understand this. You begin as a no-star recruit amongst our ranks. In other words, you have no rank at all. Perform well as a member of the Survey Corps and you, and you will move up through the ranks. Indeed, the more you add to the Pokedex, the higher your rank will become. And working on the Pokedex, of course, will bring you closer towards that goal of yours. To seek out every last Pokemon. Here, you will need this. Obtain the recipe for cream. Nice! One Acorn and one Tumblestone. Nice. And 3,000 Poke Dollars as well. You'll have the money. You'll have to buy the necessary materials. Akari, you're an ex expert at crafting yourself. Teach our new recruit what he needs to know. Of course, Captain Silene. Now, as the experienced craftsperson here, let me explain a bit to start with. Crafting means taking, making items with your own two hands. You can buy some items at the general store, but self-sufficiency is worth striving for. You can even make our most valuable tools, Pokeballs. Think would be if we didn't do that. Let's head to the Craftworks. Nice. 
So, this is the only Pokemon game where you can actually catch them all. Yes. And I'm very thankful for that, because I hate how, like, in the previous games, the Pokedex was just kind of there. Like, there was never actually any, like, uh... Like, there was never actually any, like, reason to catch things. You know what I mean? Like, it, it just... Yeah, I guess you can complete it, but, like, it's... Th there was no real reward for it. Also, I'm doing a quick search on what the, the Pokemon I'm thinking of is called. Chuckle, that's what it was. Final, do you want to be the very best like no one ever was? No, I just want to be pretty good. I don't want to be some sort of legendary asshole. You know what I mean? Like, I don't, I don't strive to be the best. I just strive to do my best. So yeah, my first shiny was a Chuckle. Because you don't fuck with the Chuckle. Well done, well done earning your place on our team. My name is Antha. I'm the local clothier. The professor asked, I'm ready for a change of clothes. Oh, here you go. Hope they do fit. Everyday kimono and a pair of everyday trousers. Nice. I hope you'll avail of, of yourself. Uh, I hope you'll avail some of your... Of, holy fuck, I cannot read. I hope you'll avail yourself of the village's humble shops. This way to the craft works. Okie dokie. This is the opening lyrics to the Pokemon anime intro of the Indigo League. Yep. You don't shock with the fuck up. <laughs> Anytime you you can use the workbench here, the craft works uh, to make an item in the village. Nice. That's a, that's a fun little crafting table. I'll supply you with what you need to make your first Pokeballs once you're ready to begin. Call it my way of saying congratulations on joining us. Just spend the money what you got from the captain on clothes, or whatever you think is best. Go up to the workbench and choose an item to craft, in this case a Pokeball. Nice. Oh, now that's, some, now that's some fine craftsmanship. Hard to believe this was your first time stepping up to the workbench, my boy. You recall, of course, that Pokemon possesses the odd power to shrink themselves down. With the power balls we craft, we can make use of that power to catch them. All that and so much... All that so more Pokemon species can duly be recorded in the Pokedex. On that note, here you are. Yay! Watching a YouTube video, Arceus is heckin' massive. Oh god, I was hoping... Because I know previous to... Uh, like in Platinum and whatnot, the... Oh, interesting. Previous to... Uh, like, or sorry, Platinum, and like, those, it was only like, twice the height of you, I guess. Prepare this volume just for you. I hope it adds to you, I hope it aids you well in your aim to seek out all the Pokemon there are in this grand region. You'll have to complete lots of research tasks to help the professor fill the Pokedex. Same goes for me, of course. I've also got Pokemon to research as a sort of a core member. 
I'd be all too happy to explain more of the research tasks I could use your assistance with. Come join me in the Fieldlands camp when you're ready, my good final. Excuse me, I couldn't help it over here. If you're going to the Fieldlands camp, would you mind taking care of a request for me? I'm standing guard so I can't leave my post, but I'll be here quarter headquarters if you want to talk about it. People have something to ask you will have a request icon displayed above them. If you fulfill the request, you may Ooh, rewards. This is a Pokemon called the Wormpole. Have you heard of it? Yes. See, I was having a chat with Professor Levinson and he told me that after a Pokemon gains a certain amount of experience through battling and the like, it will sometimes change its appearance and become stronger. He said it was a phenomenon called evolution. So I decided I want to raise a Wurmple myself and have it evolve. You're part of the Survey Corps, aren't you? If you catch a Wurmple, would you, could you let me have it? They'll be word, rewarded for you, I promise. If you can get me a Wurmple, if you can. I like how you actually get, like... Things. Where's the clothes shop? I won't flip, I won't close. You're near the camera that fell from the sky. You're heading outside the village? Of course you are. The survey core must have the must have to get out to complete compile that Pokedex. Book they're working on, right? Well, on your way, kindly do me a favor, find all about Starly. Pokemon certainly are terrifying creatures, not when I see Starly. I feel simply feel whole. Not that I have the least desire to actually touch one, mind you. So please let me see Starly's entry in that Pokédex the moment you've completed it. So you actually have to do more than just catching it. Interesting. See, let me go on if it's... Oh, hold on a second. It's better to do the quest as soon as you can because eventually the rewards become obsolete. Okay. Yeah, wait, hold on. Well, let's work on getting clothes first. <laughs> you can actually first person that, that's kind of funny. I want some clothes. Special parcel has arrived with your name on it. Shaman fancy kimono and a pair of shaman fancy bottoms. Nice. Please take good care of such fine attire. Here at the clothes here, you can purchase new clothing items such as kimonos or shoes. Let's buy clothing. Oh, they actually have like good colors this time. Like a variety of colors. You probably get more and more stuff on like Yes. You like mystery gifts when you become a first star ranked member? Okay, okay. Do you come visit my humble shop again? I wanna change my hair. How do I do that? Probably the scissors lady. Welcome young man, what can I help you with today? Hairstyling. Smother, let's go inside. Go and have yourself a seat. I'll put your things aside for you. Now then, my dear, what sort of like look would you like to go for? How do I change? Oh, I can't change.
Okay, short. For the time being, I think I'll actually... Are you sure, Drew? Yes. Oh, fuck. What the hell? Give me a second, guys. What the hell? Oh, what the hell? No, 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 no! I'll, I'll be right back.
I'm I'm back. Sorry about that. back. Yep, I am back. <sighs> Sorry. Sorry I was going so long. Shall I fetch your hat? Yes. Thank you for coming today to take care and not to leave anything behind. Come back anytime, dear. I know Shinx's ears had odd markings inside, but what are they? It's no use. I can't remember. This will keep me up all night. Aren't you with the survey corps? If you catch a Shinx, can you show it to me? I gotta see one with my own eyes. Please, I can't remember me with the life. Those ears looks like it's driving me up the wall. Got one of those shrinks to show me. Alrighty, let's have a peek at those round ears. Have a yellow cross pattern on, kind of like a star. Can't tell you what a relief it is. Felt like I had a bone stuck in my throat. Only the throat's my brain and a, the bones of thought. Thanks for helping me get that bone out. Wait, does this mean I can finish this one? How the hell do I use a Pokedex again? I guess it depends on how much I've caught them. Hope everybody's doing well. Bastards, how as many Pokemon you catch. Collect them from here to change up your party. Pokemon of the same species really come in different sizes. I never professor said so, but I have a hard time believing until I see different sizes ones lined up by side by side. If there's really if there really are boys all bigger than mine, I'd love to see them alongside the one I have, for comparison's sake. And you're natural when it comes to Pokemon, right? I see bet you see where I'm going with this. If you catch a boizel bigger than mine, would you let me have it? It'll make it worth your while. Gotta expand this year fields to fill all the new folks coming to the village. It's tough picking berries out in the wild, so I'm hoping we can grow them here instead. The village you're gonna have... What kind of harvest are you, apricorn? We 500 for that one, yes. The crops are in good hands, awesome.
Pokemon balls is only a good kid, just don't throw away your life. Okay. So you're the new recruit from the Survey Corps, don't slack off on making that Pokedex of yours. Shrine Guardian, watch over us. The seal sells various protective charms that come in handy when you're out and exploring the wilds. You're already close to passing me, I think, but I could be wrong. Okay. My foot's twitching. A new child, you came here with a prayer for the shrine. Perhaps my charms can help. Tell me, what is your wish? Stay in good health. I have a charm for that, my dear. It's yours for 500. How's that sound? Sure. This chart is imbued with the mysterious powers of the Shrine Guardian. May it serve you well. Warding charm R. Mysterious charm that holds the power to protect the person from being afflicted with status conditions. Nice. This type of charm comes in five different colors. Do you have any other wishes? No wishes for me. Come against you if you wish for another charm. Okay. Item storage again. I think I've explored everywhere. I didn't explore the main alleyway. Stay safe out there, kid. Let's go here. In Sinnoh, you catch Pokemon, and Mother Hutsui Pokemon catch you. Yeah. Righto, let's get to it then, shall we? In order to complete this Pokedex of ours, there are a great many research tasks I'll need your help to carry out, my boy. The details of these tasks can be found in the Pokedex for you to reference any time. Tasks you need to carry to complete the Pokedex. Each Pokemon species has a different number of var variety of research tasks. Press down button to open your pre pro blah blah blah. Focus on what Pokemon you can use the ZL button to initially check the research tasks. For that species. Oh, that's useful. You must catch and battle diverse Pokemon species to carry out plenty of research tasks. Do so and you'll gain a research points and other rewards for your work. One last piece of advice, final. If you see a wild Pokemon's attack coming your way, dodge it like your life depends on it. Dodge. Here, watch closely and remember what I do so you could do it later. Up. That beautiful flow, flowing bit of gymnastics is what we call the dodge. If you're light on your feet, you can dodge out of the way of wild Pokemon attacks. That way, hopefully, you can avoid taking a beating and blocking out in the wilderness. The security corps had to collect me when I got the business end of some Shinx Thundershock. Don't you worry, I've got lots of experience to draw on, and I'll teach you plenty. The starting thing evolutions is catching 80 EVs. Oh, wow. 
Also, fuck, I'm dropping frames again. Tasks with two arrows next to them are worth two points. All other tasks are worth one. Okay. Share some survey core wisdom. Focus on a Pokemon with ZL, draw first down throw by the Pokedex. You'll see what the textbook will be. Minus the research task to do with how many Bidoof you've caught. That's why catching one is enough. You need two, then four, then more and more. Okay. When it's time to battle the Pokemon, remember the captain's switching wisdom. If you have items out, press X to ready Pokemon. Give it an if you want to go ahead. I'm sorry if I seem zapped of energy, guys. Uh, 25 Bidoof cut, what the fuck? Investigated the Bidoof that bothered the village. Okay. Um... Okay. Remember, you can check task progress by pressing D pad down on A in the Pokemon page. Yeah. I think you've got it, but as a reminder, don't forget to open your Pokedex. Uh, when you focus on a Pokemon, to check your research tasks for it. Just set all them down. Try checking, checking your tasks for Starly next. One of your attacks is to catch the of being spotted for that task. Try catching them, okay. But if investigation is equest to you, okay. At least that's relatively easy. A simple quest here, okay. Nice. Hey, yo, how's this game so far? The only it's, it's the only game I've seen someone invested for ages. It's it's I think it's fun. I apologize if I seem low energy though.
to stunt the move. Interesting. Oh, it dropped an apricorn. Neat. Fuck off. <sighs> Fuck off. Anyway, Spug, how's it going? How are you? Definitely snuck up on that leak. Oh, what was that? There's a good idea to aim slightly higher than the autofocus aims of the Pokemon as far away. Okay. So it does arc instead of homing. Okay. That's good to know. I didn't see him there. Nice. Normal is weak to rock now in this game, by the way. Really. Back, man, is life, life is rough sometimes. It definitely is. Welcome back, Let's Fix. Seems having a weekly mental breakdown, big lulls. I, I don't blame you, same here. Just having dinner with family? Nice. Nice. Anyways, how is everybody doing? How's it going, Shiro? No. Fuck, that's not what I meant to do. Oh, 
Wow. Gnoblin. <laughs> Seems like my little sister's harmless, but the phrase don't close your door really gives me really bad memories. If you see your Pokemon not a tree shaking, that means there's a Pokemon hiding in it. Oh, okay. Oh, I can have multiple out. Oh. What the hell is this? Anyways, how's Poker D's not been? It's been good. Set of tree. Oh, so that's dumb stone, okay. Help, how does a one kick a seven year old out of your own politely? Distract him with food, hey, why don't you go get snacks or something? Here you can find a Pokemon called Weasel, it's, n it's got an aggressive disposition. That means it'll try to hit you with its move just like Shinx, and you need to battle to catch it. Take too much damage, and within a short time, you'll danger of blacking out. You can tell you're in danger with when the edge of the screens turn red. Okay. Take further damage and the edge of the screens have turned red, you'll become overwhelmed and black out. Speaking of which, your research tasks include seeing it use a certain move. To be precise, you have to use see that see it to use that move in battle. That's why it requires some battling. So going ahead, I'll take care of some Weasel's research tasks and come to Mark. Water now. Oh, I can. Nice. Oh. Okay, so I can't take damage right away. Something we just ate. Social batteries drained. I just can't deal. Also, do we get a punch Pokemon? I don't think so. Apparently, they can get Firestone with other red rock deposits, but they're a very red drop. Okay. Can you get Bell Dumbs in this game? I hope so.
your trainer name every Pokemon? Sure. Doing well, quite well for yourself. Your little reward for keeping up with me, your own crafting kits. Nice. Containing everything even when there's no workbench around. However, you can only use materials you have in your satchel. Okay. And there's a recipe for potions too. Nice. Orn Bear in Medicinal Lake. Nice. Dawn with long hair. Yeah, I think it's cute. The crafting key, you can. Blah, blah, blah. As long as you got an Apricorn and Tumble Stone, you can make a Pokeball anytime. Nice. Or with an Orn Bear in a Medicinal Lake, you can make a potion and, and do heal your Pokemon. So do heal your Pokemon. How goes your research? Cover your Pokedex will tell you if there are tasks you finish and can report. 21. Please we're back to uh, Leventon once you've done some research tasks good and done. Are the Pokeballs actually fucking nuts? Yes, they are. Better is actually feel good about my drugs. Nice. If he's found in horseshoe plains where you're now, where you are now, and is a rare spawn. Big shout out to Dad. Yeah. Medicine crafting kit. You must have listened attentively to Akari's teachings. Excellent work, dear boy. It seems like a good time to explain to you about survey reports and the rewards they offer. On that note, let me check the research tasks you've completed thus far. Nice. That's quite a bit of money. I see most illuminating. I'll update our Pokedex with its new data. Oh, sorry, what did that say? If you raise a Pokemon's entry to level 10, that entry will be considered complete, and you will have unlocked all the detailed information to be had about that species. As you carry out tasks and complete Pokedex entries for different species, you also gain Pokemon research points, which you can view on the cover of your Pokedex. Once you've earned a certain number of points, you'll be able to move up through the ranks of the Galaxy of Fresh Team. Interesting. Why are we talking to Shady Man? Anyways, I'm renaming the currency to penis coin. Nice. I to resuscitate a steam controller. How did you resuscitate it? Ah, not quite there yet. I'm afraid you'll need to complete a few more research tasks before you're ready to go up a rank. I recommend you work your way through Bidoof's and Starly's tasks first. Hang in there. Okay.
pointing a jump button. I don't want to talk to him. Yeah, he... Here's what happens if I get struck. Nice, okay. Pokeballs do have a range limit, okay. Spoiled apricorn, nice. Oh, there's a fucking lot of shanks here. Mr. Maddox is surely pleased. Nice. Ouch. Okay, thanks, bye. Oh no, I dazed it. Where'd Pokemon home? Bronzor and Bronzong are green. Interesting. Mastered. Oh, Moise, thank you so much for the raid. How's it going? Uh, 
cycle ended? Nice. How did, how did, how did it go? Like, was it a... Was it a good final battle? Or was it like a clean sweep? I need some more of that stone. The other Pokemon that did was a Munchlax, so I could heal a different Pokemon. Well, I'm glad you at least managed to sack something. so many max raid battles because of Martin's Soul Rock. Soul Rock is like the second most useless thing there. Did you, did you, what did you do afterwards? You just. Oh, I can do this strong and agile style. Oh, don't do too much. Um. for Starlies. The rest of the Starlies just look shocked. Oh shit, my friend just got. I just can't believe I made a randomizer Nuzlocke. Such a fucking relief. Are you gonna move on to a different uh, Pokemon Nuzlocke or? Lurk death or something catch? Okie doke. Will always be a never ending cycle. <laughs> oh. I hit the poor bastard with it. So I'm out of berries now. I need more of that stone. Shanks's, Shanks's, more Shanks's. I 
Anyways, Moist, like, how are you doing? That's how it performs. Not that way, that's Shinx area. I can't catch the Starlies. Plank picks them on, nice. Stupid tumble stone. hell's in here? Oh, it's a Bidoof. Okay. Double slap hits more than two times. <laughs> oh, is that a... It's adorable. I want to get up close to it. Oh, it looks cute. <laughs> Drifling's second best mon. <laughs> Yay. So it just disappeared. This game has a normal ghost type Pokemon. Why is that normal weak to rock now? Probably. to the leak for me. <laughs> nice. Oh, what the hell? Oh, 
Oh fuck. Fucking. Ow. Oh. Oh, there's an Eevee there. Oh, okay. Keep fucking throwing them, fuck. Is there multiple now?
Wait, why did it go twice? Action speed is a factor that it says, in the yeah. I just, it, was, it was just a back and forth for four. progress on these research tasks. Final, I do believe you're ready to move up in the ranks. Let's head back to the village and report the good news to Captain Silene. It's time you earned yourself a star. Cake lure base. Type of field provision that enhances the flavor of other types of foods it's mixed with. Interesting. Say that hunger is the best seasoning, but I'd rather rely on the quality of my soot, soot foot roots to make my potato mochi tasty. So, what could this decide? It just wants to be a pain in the ass today? Ah. As it usually does. Oh, you've completed Starley's entry in your Pokedex? Sorry, let me read it. Wait a moment. Male and female Starley have different appearances. Let me see. Markings on their forehead are different sizes. Hmm. You can let me read its Pokedex entry. Now that I know more about it, I imagine I might finally bring myself to touch a Starley. Please, if you can find a heart, let me catch a Starley and bring it to me. There's not a Pokemon in the world so adorable as Starley, I tell you. Here, have a Starly. Smooth curl of the f uh, feather on its head. Those lovely round eyes. Those lovely thin through. A door, a door down to the last feather. Oh, the Starly. Do you want to pet it? No. <laughs> I'm quite satisfied just looking at it after all. Besides, it might let loose a move. Who else at the Survey Corps or Security Corps would actually do something so frightful? As approach a Pokemon of Lingfly. All the same, I must thank you for showing me this sweet Starly. Some people will see a Pokemon simply flee on sight, you know? Perhaps being able to read all about Pokemon in that Pokedex might put them more at ease. Also, the final one, are you? I'm not doing so hot. Thanks for asking. I already think I already did this one. Did I? Photography studio. Come on in and give it a try. Sure. USB-C cable and I've been trying to connect my outputs to computer. Would you cut dozen when I try to fully connect it so that I can use Team Vera? Just won't give me the stuff I need. The Oculus app won't work. Which means I cannot connect my Oculus to computer. Which furthermore means I will not be able to get Phasmophobia nor Steam VR content. Really, that's extremely odd. This is a photograph photographing folk with their Pokemon. Why not have your photo taken? Sure.
Where are you taking photos? I need to do that. Uh, one of the buildings near the, the gate. Does streamer reach the chat? Fucking... Sorry. Interesting. Okay, I didn't take a picture, but just bugging you, I know. I apologize, I just <laughs> you know what, let's let's craft some more Pokeballs. Oh, it's... Remedy, honey cake, ox power, ox guard, oh, I see, okay. Actually, remedy might be useful. I want to do more for Oculus right now, but I don't want to deal with it. Yeah, no, understandably so. Or healed, okay. Five online mods moment, nice. Translate of Legends RCs, so imag imagine move to VR games, but have a nice stream fire. Okay. Thanks, Henry. Take care, man. Pokey can give me, yes. Here you go. I have a Warple. Yes. The one, one, you must be as good as the rumors say. I like to rename this Warple right away. I've been known to told Warple will evolve into a Pokemon known as Beautify, so I should give it with the name in mind. It's a tough decision. Which of these do you like best? Beotisha, Beautifred, or Bugene? Eugene. Eugene. Guess that's decided then. Cool. 
cool. I've got some honey. I didn't actually catch a weasel, never mind. If you have progress to report, I will judge for that. Show me your Pokedex. You have made progress. It seems you have earned yourself a star. With this, you have officially gained the retained the rank of first star in the Galaxy Expedition Team. Nice. You can now use heavy balls. Wow. Pokemon up to level 20 will also obey your orders reliably in battle. Oh, so basically your quote-unquote gym progress. The words you earn for your survey reports will be more generous now, too. These are all well, there for the recipes you'll need for crafting. Crafting recipe for heavy ball. Nice. Apricorn black tunnel stone. Ref revives, nice. Vivid choke medicinal leaks, nice. That a stranger like you should fall from the sky and yet flourish among us like th like this is a testament to your native talents and hard work. Most people pr prefer it when things are done simple enough to be judged on face value alone. Proving your worth by moving up through our ranks is somewhat anyone can understand. Keep at it, and even if you did fall from the sky, people more, be, may be more willing to accept you. Working your way through the ranks will also be a help if you wish to make a life for yourself here. A higher rank will grant you access to more types of Pokeballs and greater rewards. Nice. For today at least, you've earned yourself a meal at the Wallflower for and a good night's rest. So final, my boy. I believe a jolly good congratulations is in order. Well done on earning your first star rank. Potato Moki tastes so much better when you have something to be happy about. Still, we'll be very busy from now on between our survey core duties and requests from folks here. Which reminds me, have you already taken on that quest from Beauregard? The people of Jubilee aren't too familiar with Pokemon, you see. So if problems arise, the survey core gets called to help. Indeed so. Some people will ask you for help when you talk with them, while other requests will need to be claimed from the blackboard I keep in my lab. Speaking of which, weren't you approached with a request for Galena or Curry? With what Kairi was it all about? But that I was thinking maybe Final could handle it for me. I was told it required a bit of a skill with battling Pokemon, so... Yes, the request came from my of the Diamond Clan. Is there going to be a Diamond Clan, a Pearl Clan, and a Platinum Clan? I recall, the people of the Diamond Clan have lived in Hisui since before the Galaxy team arrived. We can establish good relations, I'm sure there was much we might learn from them. Uh, including about more about the lo local Pokemon. But we can discuss all that tomorrow. For today, we should eat up and get some rest. The next day. Listen, do you have a bit of time after this? There's something I could use your help with. Alright. Thank you, I'll be waiting for you at the training grounds then. If you caught a lot of Pokemon, you might want to visit the pastures and change up your team. Alright, I think I'm actually going to call it quits here for today. That sucks, I can't pull up my...
I actually do kind of like those better. Never mind, I can't wear it. Yeah, I know. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna... Yeah. Oh. I have to... No. No, not that one. Oh, mystery gifts. Eric Nixon's internet. <laughs> Searching for gifts. Clothing gifts, nice. Fancy kimono, fancy bottoms, baneful fox mask. Okay. Uh, settings. No. Oh, the other. Oh, save. There we go. All right. Uh, yeah. Let's call it quits and raid somebody. I apologize for the extreme lack of energy at the end. I just had a fucking panic attack and whatever. I don't, I don't care. Anyways, um, let's see. Uh, Sawyer, Minehot, Bathwater Bro. Let's just raid mine on. Excuse me. Um, raid message will be... What is he playing? Stardew Valley? Okay. There's the raid message, feel free to use that. Um, and I hope everybody has a good rest of your day. Take care.